she was pregnant for uh, nine months and she was she was kidnapped at uh, Old John Sabah Road. Um, when we noticed her absence, we searched for her at various hospitals in Sakurade. When we got back from our routine, uh, my in-law, my mother-in-law, came back with a cry saying uh, uh, some guys have called her to tell her that uh, her daughter has been kidnapped. She, uh, she has her daughter, so she should bring up some ransom for them to release her. After saying that, just that they just hung up. And since then, we had no calls from them again. And uh, just yesterday, we had a strange call, an unknown number calling us that um, uh, she has found a certain lady who can speak, uh, well, who can talk, uh, and um, she was able to write something on the paper for them, which was my number and then my name as well. So they called. So I also asked them if they can describe or like take a picture of her and then send it to us. So they describe her and from their description, we noticed that it was her. So we came here to Alvin and God means it, so we found her. So right now we are at um, Alvin Hospital where she's taking uh, uh, medical attention. Yeah. So what is the doctor looking for? I mean, what is she being treated for, treated for in the hospital? We heard nothing from the doctor, nor the police. When we got the call at first, we called the police to notify them that this is what we've heard. So we are, uh, we don't know what to do. So they, they asked us to come and then have a look at it. So when we came, like uh, less than an hour or two, they also came in. Yeah. But since then, they've not given us any information. They've said nothing concerning our work. But we've asked them, they kept saying that they are still investigating. Who did you ask? The police. Have you spoken to the doctor about your wife's condition? No. Nah, we've not even seen the doctor. You haven't seen the doctor? Yeah. Where is your wife currently? Do you know where, which part of the hospital she's been admitted? Uh, yes, hospital. At the magazine hospital, so uh, I think it's the emergency unit. Yeah. So when did you bring her to the hospital? Yesterday when we found her. And since then you haven't seen her? Yeah, oh, this morning we saw her. saw her. You've seen her this morning, but you haven't yeah. met the doctor who is taking care of her? No. All right. Um, so, did you say your wife was pregnant? Yeah, she was pregnant. Nine months pregnant. How do you prove that she's pregnant? Does she have anything to prove she was pregnant? Yeah, we have pictures of her to prove that she was pregnant. And she was attending an antenatal, which she has a um, um, pregnancy uh, uh, record book to as well. And so many people in um, Sekinita Kwade can testify that she was pregnant. I see. And so, when she returned, in which state did you meet her? I mean, when you found your wife, in which state was she in? Uh, I don't know what to say. But the pregnancy was not there. And, uh, like, it, it looks like someone who has been to some muddy place or something. Yeah. But she, she, she was able to recognize her and everything. Yeah. Mm. And, and is this her first pregnancy? No. Nah. She already has... How many children do you have with her? We have one kid already. Okay. And this was supposed to be your second child? Yeah. And so, um, since you've seen her this morning, has she been able to utter a word or even communicate something to you? No, she has not been able to utter a word, but... If access something, she can't speak, so she just use uh, hands to uh, 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 just do some sign as well. I'm feeling fine. I asked her how um, she's feeling, and she says she's fine. Yeah. 
And so, um, what do you think would commit such um, take your your wife away from you, abduct her? Do you have any suspicions of of what might have happened that day? No, we don't have any idea. Mm. So, what will be the next step for you now? Right now, we thank God that she alive responding to treatment. So right now what we are waiting for is for the doctors and the police to release her to, to release her to us so that she can take her home and then ask her some questions. Right. The day your wife went missing, um did you launch an, a, a report with the police? Yeah, the very same day. That very same day. Which yeah. police which police uh, department did you launch your complaint with? Um, Sakrade Central Police Station. Okay, and do you have an idea of any of the officers, the names who were present at the time? Uh, yeah, the name of the CID that I gave the case to was uh, Inspector Hakim. All right. And, and since you launched the complaint, what kind of work went into it? What, what was the response from the police um, on the day you, you reported the incident? Okay, they recorded my uh, my statement and then they called on my in-law too. They also recorded her also, um, statement. Then they gave us an assurance that they will, find their, uh, uh, they will find my wife and all those who are responsible. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe and click on that bell icon and get notified every time we share something new. You know we always share something new. Stay consistent.